Hello and welcome back to yet another episode of um, my channel. Thank you for you new subscribers out there. Uh, makes me happy. Thank you. Means a lot. Today we're gonna disconnect the crane from the truck itself. First thing you gotta do is you wanna you wanna disconnect your truck from the trailer. Yeah, that's step number one. So uh, let's do it. Let's do that. Let's uh, copra copra bot slap Yavin. Then you want to put your oil flow thingy on so the star the crane can move and the power for the the crane and the dump the air on the truck and then we walk outside again This is the mo most important thing. If you don't put this in, the, the crane will uh, fall down. You're gonna see why in a minute, or a couple of minutes maybe. This is like a safety thing, so the hydraulic thing is won't slide in when you don't want them to. And you just put the legs down a little bit, a tiny bit. I'm gonna put this thing here. And then you just take uh, this thingy. Something like that. Then you gotta take this safety thing out. And then you wanna press the red button. And then I always make sure that I got that one in and that one in before, before I press the red button because then that is happening. So now the crane is uh, finally out there, reattached or not, not attached. Uh, yeah. And you want to move, stand on this side. Oh wait, like that. Should should have brought my 
GoPro harness thingy. And then you just push the legs up and off comes the crane. Like, like that. Put this back. In its holder. And then you walk back to the car. Oh, that's how, how I do it. And then you turn off the oil and oil, electric, electrical, electrical stuff. And I'm gonna put you here. Maybe you can see, hopefully. Take this off, put that thing off. And then you wanna, you just wanna take a look at everything and don't feel stressed because accidents happen you know I, I know some people who have messed this part up a lot of people including me one one time i forgot to take the hydraulic hoses slangerna off was not a good thing some people forget to um, put these in so when you drive away, drive away, the whole thing falls, falls down. Yeah. So, not today. Hopefully not. Yeah. So, let's reattach Slap Yavin, the, the trailer. Then, because I'm paranoid, paranoid, I always slide forward really gently like this. And I see it, then I can see if something moves or if I hear something weird. I kind of, I can stop before something happens, hopefully. Everything seemed fine, even though I was talking the whole time, so. <laughs> so, looks good. Crane is off, like that, yeah. So, now we wanna reconnect our trailer. Wagon, wagon I tell you! We have this nice little camera we can look at if we want. You know, back in my days when I was a kid, we didn't used to have ca cameras like this. And then I can uh, dump it on the, the air a little bit so it slides in better. Oh, look at that. So then we walk out, we take our legs, we walk out to the trail machine. That's it. I'll see you when it's time to connect connect the crane. Been to Pite, Norrbotten County. Now it's time to uh, connect the crane. The crane. Let's do it.
then, then what you want to do is you want to put your hydraulic hoses back on. And you want to give them a blow job. Some sound effects. that and then we want some oil to start flowing and electricity oh not not air Looks good and good. Needs to come down more on this side. Like that. Safety thingy. We can put you on the crane. So that was uh, this week's episode and um, not the most interesting maybe, but hopefully something. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching this week's episode. I'll see you next week. Bye.